Tiber Richard Mackin, the 18th of March 1939 to the 24th of March 2016, was a Hungarian American philosopher. A professor emeritus in the Department of Philosophy at Auburn University, Mackin held the R. C. Hoyles Chair of Business Ethics and Free Enterprise at the Argyros School of Business and Economics at Chapman University in Orange, California until 31 December 2014. He was a research fellow at the Hoover Institution at Stanford University, a research fellow at the Independent Institute, an adjunct scholar at the Cato Institute, and an adjunct faculty member of the Ludwig von Mises Institute. Mackin was a syndicated and freelance columnist, author of more than 100 scholarly papers and more than 40 books, among them Why Is Everyone Else Wrong? Springer, 2008. He was, until spring 2015, senior contributing editor at the Daily Bell. He was senior fellow at the Heartland Institute in Arlington Heights, Illinois. Mackin rejected any division of libertarianism into left wing and right wing. He held that, by its nature, libertarianism is about political liberty for all individuals to do whatever is peaceful and non-aggressive. Mackin was a monarchist. Topic life Mackin was born in Budapest. Mackin's father hired a smuggler to get him out of Hungary when he was 14 years of age and he came to the United States three years later, in 1956. By 1965, Mackin graduated from Claremont McKenna College then Claremont Men's College. He took his Master's of Arts in Philosophy at New York University from 1965 to 1966, and his Ph.D. in Philosophy at University of California, Santa Barbara, 1966 to 1971. In 1970, with Robert W. Poole Jr. and Manuel Klausner, he purchased Reason magazine, which has since become the leading libertarian periodical in America. Mackin edited Reason for two years and was the editor of Reason Papers, an annual journal of interdisciplinary normative studies, for 25 years. He was a visiting professor at the United States Military Academy at West Point in 1992–1993 and taught at universities in California, New York, Switzerland, and Alabama. He lectured in Europe, South Africa, New Zealand, Budapest, Hungary, Prague, Czech Republic, Azerbaijan, Republic of Georgia, Armenia, and Latin America on business ethics and political philosophy. He sat on the advisory boards for several foundations and think tanks, and served on the founding board of the Jacob J. Javits Graduate Fellowship Program of the U.S. Department of Education. Mackin was selected as the 2003 President of the American Society for Value Inquiry, and delivered the Presidential Address on 29 December 2002, in Philadelphia, at the Eastern Division meetings of the American Philosophical Association, titled Aristotle and Business. He was on the board of the Association for Private Enterprise Education for several terms. Mackin was an advisor to Freedom Communications, Inc. on libertarian issues from 1996 to 2014. Mackin wrote a memoir, The Man Without a Hobby, Adventures of a Gregarious Egoist Hamilton Books, 2004, second edition 2012. On 24 March 2016, he died at the age of 77. <laughs> <laughs> Academic work Mackin's work usually focused on ethics and political philosophy, specifically natural rights theory, as in works such as Individuals and Their Rights Open Court, 1989, and Libertarianism Defended Ashgate, 2006. He defended the arguments of Ayn Rand for ethical egoism, and also wrote frequently on business ethics, a field in which he deployed a neo-Aristotelian ethical stance whereby commercial and business conduct gain their moral standing by constituting extensions of the virtues of productivity and prudence. He argued that the field presupposes the institution of the right to private property one cannot trade what one does not own or hasn't been authorized to trade by the owner in the works, the business of commerce, examining an honorable profession, and a primer on business ethics, both with James Cheshire, and the morality of business, a profession of human wealth care Springer, 2007. His full ethical position was developed in his book Classical Individualism, The Supreme Importance of Each Human Being Routledge, 1998, and it is applied in, among other books, Generosity, Virtue in Civil Society Cato Institute, 1998. Mackin also wrote in the field of epistemology. 
His main focus was to challenge the conception of human knowledge whereby to know that p amounts to having reached a final, perfect, timeless, and finished understanding of p instead. Mackin developed Ayn Rand's contextual conception of human knowledge from Rand's introduction to objectivist epistemology, but also draws on the insights of J. L. Austin, from his paper, Other Minds, and Gilbert Harmon, from his book Thought, in works such as Objectivity. Ashgate, 2004. Mackin worked on the problem of free will and defended a secular, naturalist but not materialist notion of human initiative in his books The Pseudo-Science of B. F. Skinner 1974, 2007 and Initiative, Human Agency and Society 2000. Mackin argued against animal rights in his widely reprinted paper, "'Do Animals Have Rights?' 1991 and in his book Putting Humans First, Why We Are Nature's Favorite 2004, but he also wrote on the ethics of animal treatment in his book Putting Humans First 2004. He was also a skeptic as to whether governments are able to help with global warming and whether human beings have made significant contributions to climate change. On 1 May 2011, Mackin was featured in a three-hour interview on C-SPAN 2's in-depth program as its selection of an author from the Western United States of America. Personal life Mackin lived in Silverado Canyon, California. He was previously married to Marty Zupin. He had three children and four grandchildren. Bibliography The Pseudo-Science of B.F. Skinner. New Rochelle, New York, Arlington House Publishers, 1974. The Libertarian Alternative, Nelson Hall, 1974. Human Rights and Human Liberties, Nelson Hall, 1975. Recent Work in Ethical Egoism, American Philosophical Quarterly, Vol. 16, Number no. 1, 1979, pp. 1 to 15. The Libertarian Reader, Roman and Littlefield, 1982. Individuals and Their Rights, Open Court, 1989. Capitalism and Individualism: Reframing the Argument for the Free Society, Street. Martin's Publishing Co. and Harvester Wheatsheaf Books, 1990. Private Rights and Public Illusions. Transaction Publishers for the Independent Institute, 1994. Classical Individualism. Routledge, 1998. Generosity, Virtue in the Civil Society. Cato Institute, 1998. Libertarianism Defended. Ashgate, 2006. The Promise of Liberty, Lexington, 2009, co-authored with Rainer Ebert. Innocent Threats and the Moral Problem of Carnivorous Animals. Journal of Applied Philosophy, 29, May 2012, pp. 146 to 59. Impractical Pragmatism, Philosophy Now, 95 to 30, March to April 2013. Topic. See also. Objectivism and libertarianism Libertarianism in the United States List of American philosophers <laughs>